I've run out of boxes. <laughs> I did not calculate correctly when I placed my Amazon order, so I'm here at my local public storage, about ready to pick up some extras. Um, it's always more than you think. You know, I thought, you're moving into a fully furnished townhome that has everything. How many boxes do you need? But it's like you open up cabinets and just stuff spills out and you wonder, I've only been there a year. Where did all this come from? <sighs> and they're closed. <laughs> Hi everybody, it's a big day. It's a big, um, well, video for me <laughs> because it entails all of this. Moving day, um, never thought I'd say it, but I am moving out of the city of Houston, my home since 1974, as you guys know. You um, saw sort of my traveling around town and reminiscing about all the places where I've been and where I've grown up. And you learned in my podcast that I am moving to the Dallas-Fort Worth area for just a wonderful opportunity that will coincide with everything else that I've been doing on YouTube and social media and the podcasting. And it's just such a win-win and it's exciting. But what is not exciting yes, is yes, this. Yes, <laughs> this is exhausting. You know, I've thought about it. It's January of 2024. In August of 23, I had to move all of my mom's things out of her apartment. Six months prior, I moved here. At the same time, she moved to her new apartment. A year before that, I moved. And so I feel like there's been so much moving and so much boxing and unboxing and changing and all of that. And it's it's exhausting to go through. But when you see why and, and I get to share that part of the journey with you, you'll be like, yes you those boxes are so worth it and and it is and it will be but um right now i just got a call from the movers and they're at the loading dock so we need to let them in so this stuff can get on a truck let's go This is True Confessions moving style. I've always been so neat and tidy and I've helped Courtney and Holly organize their closets and personal space. And <laughs> I'm not coming out of the closet, but I'm coming out from under the bed because this has been an absolute, absolute technological nightmare for me, figuring out where to store all my equipment. So it all lives under here. <laughs> which I don't think is bad because at least nobody's seeing it. But just wait till you see what's living down here. Last look yet. <laughs> Don't you love moving? I mean, yeah. <laughs> You're so close. How are you feeling? I'm exhausted. <laughs> are you in my face with that? <laughs> it's never looked better. <laughs> oh, you're next. Do you all know? This one is making fun of me right now. <laughs> They sneeze from five pounds of dust <laughs> is next <laughs> because she's moving up a week after I am. Yeah. So Missy, I can't wait to hear your story. What you scheming? <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh my you. gosh, it echoes. Where's the box? <gasps> thank you. Oh my goodness, thank you. That's 
it's my sewing kit. Oh, I'll have to send you a picture of my sewing kit. What does it look like? It's brown. Is it? You're yeah. so organized and looks so nice. Thank you. Well, after my shameful under my bed experience, I needed to have something that looked good. So are you going to take these? Will you take this system, please? Look at the shoes. Yeah. I'm going to take the system. I think you need it. Look, I was just taking it apart, and I think you can figure out how to do it. And I yeah. can get Michael at the apartment to come just redo it. It would make me so happy knowing What's that expensive? you have this. Yes, and look, this is, I mean, all Girl, my it's shoes. So much better than what I have. It's the best system. I mean, I brought all of this over from the Ivy. That to this and the shoes because it fit that system and I just had it installed here, but it was a total game changer for me. So thank you. <laughs> you have been a great helper. I just, for the record, you have earned this break. <laughs> well, no, this is exclusively VIP customers of a, of a rolled out red carpet. Not well, you should real. just walk in on your red carpet. Ooh. There you go. <laughs> What gives me so much joy is Courtney came through here and you're going to notice on my furniture, <laughs> there are lots of pink dots everywhere. I think there's a pink dot on the curtain and the television and the sofa and you're getting a lot of my stuff and that makes me so happy no, because when I come to see you, I'll be like, yay, Courtney's yes. apartment is full and that looks so familiar. We're going to replicate this. Yes, place. you will. <laughs> And I am overjoyed. I'm so, so thankful. I know. And I hope you take my closet system. <laughs> <laughs> I just smiled. That was a face. moment. I know, she's I just, just smiling. I'm just smiling. Who's moving today. and who's not moving? <laughs> There's never, you can't say bye, you just no. have to say later. Yeah. yeah. I'm so proud of you. And you've taught me so much about myself. And, and my foundation is way different because of you. And you know that. Now, go kill it. Go kill it. And enjoy life. And we will do life apart. Yeah. And when we're together, it's even more rich. Yeah. Oh, all I can say is thank you, Audrey. <laughs> you, you were my parting gift from her. <laughs> thank you, Audrey. Thank you, Audrey. Yes. Are you ready for your new home? Are you ready for your new home? Mm hmm? I know. Moves are weird. I know. I know. But I'm excited for you. You're going to have so much room to walk around and play. It's going to be amazing. I think you're going to like it. I love you too. You're such a good boy. You're such a good boy. We're going to miss Houston. But he's actually from the Fort Worth area, so he's going back home. <laughs> huh. So sweat and tears and a lot of hard work and practically an entire life in one place. <laughs> I go through these moments of like, I'm fine. And then I just start crying and it's just, um, it just is what it is. But um, how do you not have feeling and emotion toward a place and the people in it? So I'm very, um, very grateful for all my experiences here. I'm grateful for this home and this roof over my head and, and the new opportunities moving forward. And I'm <coughs> super excited in this too. <laughs> it's time for a new beginning. It's what this sig signifies, January 3rd, it's a new beginning and in every way. And I'm ready for it, you know? I've, I feel like I've done everything that I can and need to and even want to do here. And I'm ready for new challenges, new goals, new experiences. And I can't wait. I got my court with me, <laughs> so I'm so excited. Oh, and I just can't wait. We promise we're not driving like this to Fort Worth. We're not. The best <laughs> just, just for the purpose of this vlog. <laughs>
We're going three miles an hour in my garage. <laughs> you ready, Oscar? Yes. <laughs>